Hey guys, welcome back to Daily Duels. So today is Saturday, means that we are slaying with Slate and owning with Omega Cast. So I decided to make it fair. Each week I'm gonna switch back and forth between the two. So it's just not like every single week you're starting out with Omega Chaos and you gotta wait all the way to the end of the video for Slate. So no, this week we are starting <clears> off with Slate and then you're gonna end with Omega Chaos. So uh, yes, here is Slate. Up. Uh, so. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> apparently his half won't be that long because he's actually going to take his permit test and he has oh, to yeah. study. <laughs> so, yeah, uh, so we'll just get this one duel in probably. Yeah. So can some, can I do the paper boxes already? Can we... I, <laughs> I picked paper, so. <laughs> like, hello. Um, so yeah, don't worry if you fail. As I said, I failed my, I failed my permit test and my driving test once each, so. <laughs> I mean, I don't even know if I'm like, what am I going to use it for? Like, I don't do anything. <laughs> <laughs> Where am I gonna go? <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, so I, I mean, I, I'm I'm kind of worried because I don't want to be like I want I want to pass it, but I mean, even if I do get my permit, I don't see what I'm gonna do with it. <laughs> I'm just gonna, I'm gonna warn you right now. Uh, study the study the odd shit. Don't don't focus on the obvious shit because yeah. because they'll get you. Because that's exactly what happened to me. Like I took the test for my first time. And I was all confident. I was like, oh, I know like all of this. And they started asking me about freaking like baby strollers and motorcycles and shit and trains. <laughs> Like, <laughs> what the fuck? Trains. <laughs> oh my god, are, are they gonna... I know, are you gonna actually fucking pivot rock scissors? Hello? I have to fucking... Can I like... Hello? You there? <laughs> you gonna choose? <laughs> I, I don't get it, I don't get it. We start to do what you go AFK, like... Like, we're not playing in rated, so it's not like, you know, we're just gonna quit and you get your, your score up. You can't call an admin. <laughs> what, what, what should I do? <laughs> I say fuck it. Let's just go get a different one. All right, let's go. Yep, bear back. Okay. Oh, these guys actually want a duel. We're back. All right. So, since you can't stay that long, I'm gonna have to make this quick because I actually decided that I'm gonna ask all the tag partners what they think about the band less one card in time. So we gotta hurry up and do this. <laughs> all right. Um. All right. Shoot. All right. You like? Do you like? Right, I'm gonna I'm gonna state each one and I'm gonna and give you opinion. Yeah, right. okay, good. So, that's what I was. So uh, starting it off, nothing banned. Um, I think they missed a couple opportunities there because there are some cards that I don't know. Like uh, so you know, soul charge obviously soul charge to one is gonna be terrible this format. So. Yeah, it's a sacky table. Like literally, I put it in the decks for vitamin Y, and I have literally since I put it in the decks for vitamin Y, I've drew it every single video. <laughs> it's it's just. <laughs> Ah, uh, uh, god damn, that was a good mill. All right. Uh, <laughs> why, why always light swords? Ugh, every single time. What's up with everybody playing with light swords? I hate that deck. It's too luck based. Uh, so what do we got for limited cards? Uh, so limited cards, we have uh, global. Yeah, I think this might be because in new challengers we're getting um. Shekinaga, so yeah. we need a good Earth target, and I think that mathematician, that, that, huh? Mathematician. Nah, it's a normal summon though. It's still an Earth target. <laughs> but what you do is you um, when you fusion from the deck, you send Glow Up Bulb, and then later you can special summon Glow Up Bulb. Yeah, and Shekinaga is uh, level ten, so with Glow Up Bulb you can make a Star Eater if you want to. <laughs> I'm getting all the pluses right now. Yeah, you are. <laughs> oh, that's clearly a Raikou right in the field, so... <laughs> that's gonna suck yeah. for me. <laughs> There's no other card that fucking lights my set besides Raikou, right so... <clears throat> so, uh, yeah. yeah. Oh, but I think that... I think people were talking about how people might start, like, playing, like, Mist Swarm again. Uh, I think that would be pretty cool if people start playing Mist Swarm again. <laughs> Why? Because you didn't get your fucking, uh, Trish Black back? Fucking idiot. <laughs> well, I mean, yeah, Mist Worm's pretty good too, though. Uh, it's good against um, Shadal's because it sends everything back to the extra deck or the hand. Oh, no, it's during good. your end phase. Interesting. I was about to say, how come you didn't die? Like, oh, it's during your end phase. All right. Yeah, that's why That's why he's good. Because you can call the haunt of him in your opponent's end phase and then he stays. Ah, uh, mmm, I drew Dark Hole. Should I just... Why are you... Oh, please, you're, you're, you're playing... Is... Is this, is this new format, or this is not new format? Okay. No, sure. not new format. I got your call. Okay. <laughs> yeah, keep going. Nah, uh, I'll fuck it. I'll attack into the fucking, uh, 
into the thing. Do you need your uh, battery, man? Uh, just give me something to tribute next turn. It I doesn't matter what it is. I can't guarantee I can give you that. Because I'm, uh, I'm gonna fucking, I'm gonna run into the fucking, I'm gonna take the, uh, the Raikou right to the face. So he might destroy the monster. Alright, just, just go ahead. Alright. Ah, God. Are you yeah. gonna do Chronic Beast for very much longer? <laughs> yeah, I like this deck. <laughs> like this deck. Why? Just, their, uh, their arts are bad. And their effects are mediocre. They're just rank four. And they're right, they're, good rank but it's four a fun deck. deck. It's, right. I don't think it's fun. Eh. Uh, I mean, there's uh, there's nothing like wrong about their play if style. If I attack into the Raikou, right he'll probably pop. And I, 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 the thing is, I want to get the Raikou. Right I want to say, fuck it. Fuck it. Give me the Raikou. Right but I just don't know what he's going to pop. You know? Marshmallow. Okay. All right, um, Marshall on and fucking your deck. All right, cool story, bro. <laughs> I'm just gonna spin you. Yeah, I'll spin you. All right. Uh, Wait, I don't. Is it? Is, do we need to spin him? Like, I can just. I can probably just bounce him next turn. But oh, that, yeah. Never mind. Because you have to. You have to get the. Because I want to call the haunted the. the yeah. yeah. So never mind. Go ahead, spin him. Yeah, I need to call the haunted the uh, nine bolt. What? I'm not worried about the martial art right now. I'm spinning the wolf. So oh, okay. I don't want him to have a four on the field. Okay, that, that makes more sense. Yeah. Because I know he'll definitely, fucking his partner will just be like, oh, I got a four? Ah, like, no. All right, I thought you were spinning the martial art. I was about to say, I can, just, I can just bounce that next turn, so. Why not march? You type damn fast, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even pay attention in typing class. <laughs> yeah, I, I mean, I don't know. I got an A in that, but I mean, that was in like 8th grade, so. I took it I'm in... not, I can't type, I can't type I, well. I took it in 6th grade and then we had like this typing program and I literally unplugged my keyboard and my, and my, my friend plugged his keyboard into my freaking computer and then he just <laughs> typed for me while I just it's played good. games. It's good. It's really good. All right, go ahead and summon um, your fucking uh, your fucking big old booty. Big fucking... Ben, big Ben K. Yeah. Big Ben K. Ben. Um, what uh, what was after your glow bulb? Uh, uh, glow bulb. Archfiend. 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 Oh, I forgot about Archfiend. Desk bots. Yes. 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 Yes, I love Despots. Oh my gosh. Despots are the best deck. Yes. I think you're over exaggerating. No, Despots are the best deck. Well, if he has Machine Dupe, dude, we're going to lose. Oh my god. Despots are the best deck. Ah, I love Despots. Um, Inferno the Arts being to 1 is going to make people play the Synchro variant. That's all I have to say. Yeah, they're going to play the Synchro variant. It's The, the deck is not dead yet. Uh, they should have banned our uh, launcher. Okay. Um. I'm so, I want to see how, oh, he just one day a piece? Goddamn. I want to see how his, uh, his Despot deck plays. I love Despots. I hyped them up a while ago on my channel. Oh my gosh, I love Despots. <laughs> the 002 got printed in the Deluxe Edition, so. Ooh, do you really think we needed to let him? Oh, okay. Hit Compulse. That's good. <laughs> um, well, I have a wiretap, so I don't think there was any need to let that, him that's, Well, that's for the other back row, in case he tries to stop your play right now. What if that's, like, not a... I don't know. It doesn't matter. Uh, okay. If it's so, not something, then it, it will, then he won't play it. But if it is something, you can wiretap it. Mm -hmm. I forgot to I forgot to talk about uh, Archfiend with my chaos, but I think let me uh, let me let me, let me let me try to get my inner chaos. Oh, I don't I don't mind. Uh, okay, Archfiend <laughs> getting hit. It was on my wish list, so I, I don't mind that. There you go. I did. <laughs> he's gonna he's probably gonna fucking kill me for doing that. Oh right. my god. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Why would you ever? <laughs> oh my god. That was great. That was great. All right. Let's, see, All right. let's see how hard I can go off here. Alright. All right. Um, Regeki. Yeah. Um, I, I mean, it was it was totally unprecedented, and there's no reason for it to be a 1 before Dark Hole is a 2, because I made some videos about Dark Hole going to 2. Like, that would have made sense a little bit, I think. But, uh, yeah. I, don't, I mean... I mean, it's not going to do anything. People might side it, and it'll be pretty. It'll be pretty sad when, when we all get sacked by it. But oh my god, 
Oh wait, I've marked that. <laughs> <laughs> wow, see? Uh number generator. You get the compulse um, and you get the warning? Uh get the fuel cell. I can uh, do so much damage. You want to do so much damage? Yeah, because look what I have in my hand. I can't see what you have in your hand. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't see what you have in your hand. Oh. Oh wow. <laughs> so I oh. guess I'll bounce the marshmallow on, right? Yeah. Alright. Hmm. Yeah. Get rid of this one. Bounce the marshmallow. And that's oh, you... all I can Can oh, I do any more? Can I do? Oh yeah. Can I do that right now? Um. I think I'm gonna do that. It's just more damage. I don't know if this is game, but it's this little combo that I thought up. Of, that I thought up. Oh, so you're gonna detach and then put them back in your hand and summon them again? Yeah. That's cool. That's cool. Uh, yeah, you know, I was, I was, I was talking about that too. Like, I would much rather you have Dark Hole at two than Regeki ever coming back because there's no, there's no repercussion. You know, you could be up on resources, drawn to, like right now. If you join the Dark Hole, of course you wouldn't play it. But freaking, if you join the Regeki, Regeki, it's go ahead. And there's destroy. no, I mean, it, it'll, it's just not good against the meta right now. But I mean, it's gonna be sided. I think. I, yeah, I mean, I know, I know, I know the inherent reason why Regeki shouldn't come back. But I mean, I don't think it's gonna be. Deal, yeah, like I, I, I don't want Konami to get into that mentality because and it's probably not going to do anything this format. I don't want Konami to get into this mentality like. Oh my God! One day of peace. All right. Yeah. Whatever. I don't want. Hey, I, I mean, what, what, in before he has Dark Hole, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. Can you um, can you overlay those two into like a, a photon strike bouncer if you have it? Yeah, I, I'm think I'm leaving my extra deck right now. I'm thinking about that. Um. But the light sword player is up next. That, that that might be a nice thing yeah. to go ahead and do is negate whatever he does. Right now he has. I can't look in the graveyard. He has one right now. So. God. Whatever. Yeah. So I don't want Konami to get into his mentality because I know. The Regeki is not going to do much this format. I don't want to be like, oh, Regeki didn't do anything this format. Put it up to three. Well, uh, um, I think <laughs> it's, I think, like I said, they have to, they have to move Dark Hole up before they do anything with Regeki. Like, what the hell? So <laughs> I just don't want Konami to do to get into that mentality. Plus, you, know? I, well, you, you can't tell me you'd play three Regeki in your deck. It would be dead draw way too much. What the fuck? I fucking Regeki the shit out of you. Like I said, it's no, just this no. current, it's just this current format that's the damn problem. It's I know, but I'm it, in any format. If, if Ragaki's at three, you can't run three. You might run two, but you can't run three. You you can't run three Ragaki in your deck. It's just not good. I don't want them to have the even the option of even being wanting to run the Ragaki. I think that's stupid. But but you agree with me, right? That that you wouldn't run three Ragaki in your deck. Depends. Depends on the deck. Depends on how aggressive your deck is. If you can, if you have a deck that that can OTK, why not throw fucking the Ragaki at him? You know, as long as you, in, in all, threes, you need, all you need to do is destroy one monster to even out. So, all right, I think we should move on because this is probably gonna end pretty soon. So, all right, um, uh, soul charge. Yeah, soul charge. <laughs> um, it should have got banned. I don't know. There's not much. To, I, I already talked about soul charge in the banned section, but um, it it people were talking like compared to Monster Reborn when it came out, right? And uh, when Monster when Soul Charge was at three, it was not a, just a better Monster Born. It was like a combo piece, right? But mm -hmm. now I think it is just a better Monster Born because you're using it in the same in the same way. You're gonna like you're gonna top deck it, and you're going to be able to set up an unbreakable board and like just you know what I mean? Yeah. So I think it, I think now you could actually consider it a, a better Monster Born. Go ahead and strike him. No, no, re he's, he's going for Lumina. Hmm. I don't think there's a reason to. Uh, okay. So he's gonna. Make wanna, him, I'll let him. I'll let him finish his play first. Okay. Well, he's obviously going Lumina for another thing. So if he targets something that can hurt me, then I'll. I'll. I'll I don't think there is anything that can hurt you right now. Exactly. Exactly. That's why I didn't bounce her. I mean, he could go into a rank three. Oh. Okay. So he's I, gonna go into an eight. Yeah. I can negate the effect of the eight though. So. But he can probably make an eight like like hot red run you over and then main phase two wipe you. You can't main phase two wipe. It's you can't? main phase one. Oh, it is main phase one? Yeah. Okay, that's good then. I don't know, I need to get me one of them. A hot red. Um uh, okay. 
Okay, well, he, I guess it's just a beater. I mean, he gets to run over one of my monsters, whatever. I should have, uh, I guess I should have bounced her. I guess. Okay, I'm probably oh, okay. worried about that. I have Trag, so I'm gonna drop Trag. Sure. Is that okay? That's fine. Uh, no, you can just mess with this level and stuff, so. Okay. Uh, what's next? What's next? Uh, Super Poly. Yeah, Super Poly. I was really surprised Wait, by this aren't one. aren't you gonna get killed by the Archfiend? No. Oh, after damage calculation was card attacks, okay. Um, I think I... What, what's his effect? Uh, what? His end phase effect? He has to destroy all, uh, monsters that didn't oh. declare attack this turn. Oh, okay. I did not know that. Holy shit, when did I get all these cards in my hand? <laughs> <laughs> Hello? I don't even remember that happening. I got so much um, shit in my hand. Super Poly was a big surprise Holy to me. shit! Uh, Turn to <laughs> fucking attack. You're about to get wrecked by the Oh my god, yes! Yeah, yeah. 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 Hello? <laughs> oh yeah. Use uh, duality, use duality. Why wouldn't you use duality? Use duality. Yeah, I'm not planning on special something this turn. You get a, yeah, you get another card though in your hand. <laughs> Give me the MST. I have too much shit in my hand. <laughs> yes! <laughs> 5400 attack, yes! Get rid of factory. <laughs> yeah. Check. Dude, you're good. <laughs> it's so perfect. Oh, oh damn. my god. Oh wow. Oh man, I think I think Super Poly was the only hit that Shadows really needed at this point because they can't directly hit anything Shadows. But um, it'll hurt the Hoven build. The Hoven build can't play anymore because Soul Charge and uh, Soul Charge and uh, Super Poly are both at one now. Mm -hmm. Super Poly is really good against the meta because. The main decks are light and dark, so they could just go into their stuff easily. Plus, next format, or not next format, but in a couple months, uh, in November, we're going to be getting two new fusions, so that can pretty much combat everything. You know what I mean? The Super Poly. So, Super Poly 1 is, is probably uh, the best. It's a, it's a good hit to so Shadows. I didn't think Shadows would really get hit at all, so it's probably a good hit. One, two, three. Damn. Still have Less semi limits? Uh, yeah, quickly. Semi limits, so. Uh... Uh, Gale. It, uh, it'll do nothing, but I like Black Wings. I've played them on your channel a couple times, so I'm going to test out two Gale and Glow Bulb in my Black Wings. Okay. And right. <laughs> okay. So, yeah. So, uh, Gorse. That was the only thing that could have impacted my Chaos deck, which of course is my real life deck. So, um, I don't think that people are actually going to play two, like, I don't think I'm going to play two Gores. And I, I don't think any meta decks have the ability to play two gores right now, so. Like, I think I think there's just a little bit too much back row right now. I know that Shadows don't play that much back row, but they do have to set the shadow games every once in a while, and, you know. Burning Abyss has all the chainables, and Satellar Knights just have, like, 30 traps in their deck, so. <laughs> uh, yeah, uh, I think that gores is, is warranted to come back to two, but it's really powerful, especially with Raigeki. You know, I'm actually surprised they moved Gorth without even considering moving Trag. Um, Trag has more versatility. That's that's like uh, the same sort of thing with Book of Moon. How Book of Moon is still at one, even though I I, I mean I know you, I know you don't like this, but uh, I think Book of Moon could come up. I also think Trag could come up. The thing is, they just have so many different like purposes. So yeah, because freaking Trag right now, is, especially since you know yeah, I I'd, I'd rather see Gorth up to three than Trag move just because. Trag, you can drop whenever, as long as you take damage on Gores, at least you have to have mm -hmm. no back, exactly. you have to have no cards in the field, you can, so. you can take their monsters, you can do a whole bunch of crazy stuff with that. Yeah, so. Um, uh, what does OCG have Trag at, two? Trag, two, yeah. Okay, and at three Gores, okay, so. I'll go ahead and edit that on my, uh, banless prediction for January, putting Gores up to three, because I doubt he'll do anything in this format, so Konami probably just move it. Uh, what can I special summon? Oh, I can special summon Gaia Charger. Okay, um, hmm. All right, I drew. Uh, ooh, I could use Heraldry Reborn. Is there anything that you get a plus off of if I special summon it from your graveyard right now? Mm, no. Okay. Because I have, I drew a Charger, so I have lots of lots. I have tons of plays. Um, do whatever you want. Do whatever you want. I trust. You. I mean, I, I really don't know what to do. <laughs> uh. All right, I'll just attribute that. Um. Okay. So does that mean does that mean that 
you can target the charger in the graveyard with Tragodia, make it five, and then be able to. Yeah, go into a Pleiades. Uh, or you not Pleiades. No, uh, uh, Volca. Volca, yeah. Yeah. Uh, what can I even, even add with Mind Bolt? Uh, tra <laughs> tra Transmigration Prophecy. Um, yeah, the reason that was at one is because of the, you can never deck out if you play two in your deck, but I mean, nobody's going to do that. Deck out decks aren't prevalent, and it's a good side card. Uh, I don't think it was at one actually for its purpose in the side deck, but I think now that it's at two, it'll see more play in the side deck. It's really good against Burning Abyss, because when they target their monster in the graveyard with uh, Seer, you can just go ahead and uh, get rid of it. Yeah, so <clears throat> uh, I wouldn't be surprised if that card went back went up to three. Uh, if you're going to put it to two, you could put it to three. So they wanted to go See's ahead and test a wire. Seize, seize fire, fuck that. Fuck that. Um, I'm sorry, fuck that. I think, I think that burn Stellar Knights are going to be a thing now uh, because they got their road out of three and also they have uh, Seize Fire to, to have, so. Yeah. Because yeah. It's, it's like all fake monsters, so they could probably go like summon, 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 Seize Fire, burn you, Scar and burn you, like... Nah, Sea Strider should have stayed at one. That should have not been a card to go up to two. I, no. and also, also, it can combat Shadows because uh, when you activate it, both effects aren't activated. Oh. So. Oh, that is pretty good. That's pretty good. That is that's a smart idea. I never thought of that. I is never this game? That. That's yeah, that's game. Unless that's a right. mirror force. Yeah. Okay. All right. So. The unlimits really fast. <laughs> yeah, unlimits really fast. I I called them. I called them except for Wolf Park, but yeah, formula. Rota shouldn't be at three. Wolf Bark, I hate Fire Fist. And why didn't you go to two first? Like, everything that got unlimited was at two first. Magician of Faith doesn't matter, and Formula Synchron doesn't matter. I mean, nobody play, nobody's going to run three Formula Synchron, so. And the hits that they missed? Um, Vanity's Emptiness and Moral Attack kind of Sanctum? Yeah, the Vanity's Emptiness, Moral Attack Sanctum. Um, uh, time Seal should be at one. <laughs> uh, so... Actually got I mean, drastic besides... dropped off in one of the daily duels. I can't remember what somebody actually drastic dropped off me. I was like, what the fuck? Okay. <laughs> I I understand that now that my comparison is like a little bit off, but I mean it's it's time seal is still not a good card. So, uh, I don't time know, that's, seal. That's I have to say. You know what? I'll reason with you. One. I think that one. Listen, I think that if it goes to one, I'm not saying it should go from one to two to three. <laughs> I'm saying that it could go to one and stay at one. Like I don't see there's a problem with it being at one right now. One. So. And besides, like, like three, well, three like, is broke it, it. because it sacks. <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, it's yeah, it's a, it's a consistency thing. But uh, think about no, it, in your... you, didn't, you didn't know time seal stacks. What? Time seal stacks. So if I go time seal, time seal, time seal, you can't draw for the next three turns. All right. All right. I mean, I never even thought about it, but I guess that matters. Um, <laughs> but think about it. You play. What's your in real? What's your in real life deck right now? Constellar Knights. Time seal goes to one. What are you going to take out of Constellar Knights? I'm nothing. I'm in deck exactly. Okay, so <laughs> yeah, that, that's all. I, that's all I have to say. All right, let's. I got to get out of here. So okay, all right. So uh, this is part one. I uh, see you guys in part two with uh, Under the Mega Calf. Uh, I actually recorded his part before this, so yeah. So uh, I'll see you guys in part two. All right, and we're back. So I did not say that. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> all right, we're back, and uh, we have Omega Chaos here. Hi, I'm our Chaos here once again. Alright, so let's get this duel started. This guy, this guy right here, this 420 duelist guy, he, he likes to blaze it up and get high. He must be getting high. His rating on here is like 700 something. Like, yeah, so that's. <laughs> like, how many rated duels did you do and then keep losing? Okay, this guy just says, fuck you, you're not attacking. I got two MSTs though. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Same here, actually. Oh, wow. <laughs> Just like, uh, fuck your surgery in life, fuck your surgery in peace, I don't care a shit. Alright, so I am going to continue doing what I'm doing with all my tag partners and ask them what they think about the band list. So, I know you actually put up a video, and so did Slate, so I will be linking their videos yep. in the description, of course, along with their channels, so you can go over to their channels and check out their content, because I know you guys want to. Well, um, you're not just gonna throw it out there. You're gonna take the deal slow. You're gonna give them that uh, sense of security. <laughs> yeah, I think so. Yeah. No point in really doing anything. The only monster I have is a battery man nine volt. Oh, you're using battery man? No, it's a rank of hundred deck actually. Oh, okay. I have to say, I can so easily kick your butt. <laughs> it's like that's my deck. <laughs> Lol. All right, so let's get started. So, uh, uh. No, wow, he just said, no, I'm not paying. <laughs> is that for both players? Or just... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, neither player. Okay, yeah, but then the obnoxious could have attacked players. anyway. Oh, but you want to equip it with your sword thing. What the fuck is going on? <laughs> is something wrong with your mic or something? Uh, no, I don't think so. Oh, okay. So I'm fine now. It's like a second day you started messing up. What the hell is going on? Like, okay. No idea. <laughs> All right. So starting off, uh, nothing banned. What do you think about nothing being banned on the list? Well, that's kind of sad for me. You're a big fan of Soul Charge getting banned. Yep. That I, that I can get rid of you. And I would have liked the Vanity Sempness to be banned, of course, as well. Yeah. Yeah, the Floodgate is so strong. Like, I, I, I'm literally, I'm just getting dirty with it. Like, in my, uh, in my Constellar Knight deck, <laughs> I'm main decking a Triple Kaiser. And right now I have two Vanities. I'm debating on pumping it to three just to win. <laughs> like, I don't care. <laughs> You know, on on here on YouTube, I have fun, but you know, with this upcoming regionals in Vegas, I I need to win. You get the fuck yeah. out of my face. <laughs> you will go off. Uh, I really don't care. Yeah, I guess Ephesbina. <laughs> so yeah, that kind of sucks. Like, I guess they are gonna reprint the vanities. I guess. I guess they're just like yeah. Yeah, most likely in the legendary collection five days. Okay. I love how that fake list said unbanned Trish and that everybody picked up Trish and it didn't get a ban. Like, how many times are you guys going to get fooled by Trish? I swear. Yeah. <laughs> like, fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on me. Like, you guys yeah, don't like. Trisha, definitely soon, soon, uh, come back. <laughs> I don't like Trisha. Uh, if Trisha doesn't come back, I, I wouldn't shed a tear. I, I don't give a crap. <laughs> All right. When it's just way too powerful. Yeah, when Trish was at its prime, I was playing you, Bell, and that just sucked Especially ass. Especially if the young sings and all that. Yeah, so, not a big fan of that. And freaking uh, Burning Abyss, they'll be able to pull out Trish with ease. Oh, yeah. <laughs> they'll probably be like, you know, send one of their freaking uh, Burning, the freaking tuner, and then they'll probably, oh, wow. <laughs> Stop <that. laughs> the, the seventh one, oh, yeah. <laughs> They'll probably just send their tuner. They're probably like, okay, special summon going around burning abyss. Crane, 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 summon back my tuner. Trish. Like, all right. <laughs> like, no, I'm not a big fan of that. So I really don't care about that. All right. So um, cards limited to one. Uh, Glow bulb. Yeah, that was a surprise. Yeah, I was just like, I, I, if they want to unban Glow bulb, I was like, fine, whatever. Yeah. Uh, if some de synchro deck wants to use, I definitely know that freaking uh, Shadals are gonna put it in there because it's Earth, so you know they're gonna definitely Shadal fuse with it into uh, uh, Shikinaga. Yeah, Sh Shikinaga, yeah. yeah. And Shikinaga's level ten, so they can actually bring that gold bulb and synchro into uh, Star Eater if they want to. That's kind of. Yeah. Uh... <laughs> Shikinaga is better than Star Eater. <laughs> yeah. And then when they use the glow bomb effect and off the card, top card of their deck, if it's a Shadal monster, they'll go ahead and get the effects since they never miss timing. <laughs> ah, what the fuck is that? Oh, okay. I am quite sure that uh, glow bomb will, will be also reprinted in the Legendary Collection 5 days. So. Yeah, uh, Regeki. What do you think about Regeki? Uh, that was uh, just a very interesting. At it. Like, what? I'm just gonna throw them in the Wow, these guys are just not doing anything. But I guess it's because uh, destruction oh. nowadays it's not that great anymore. Yeah, that's true. No, I already mentioned what I thought about it. I just, I just don't think that was the correct choice because there's no drawback to it. Yeah, that's true. You know, you're, you're gonna, you're gonna throw uh, Regeki at my ass without even second guessing yourself. At least with Dark Holes, a little bit of strategy involved. Wow. Oh, they quit. Well, we definitely gotta get another one in, so. Right yeah. back. Alright, back with another duel. So, uh... Yeah, there's just no drawback to it. Like, you know, with at least with Dark Hole, and people are always like, Oh, well, they're just gonna use Regeki like how they use Dark Hole. That may not necessarily be the case. 
Yeah. You could be up on resources out of the butt, draw to a dark hole. Of course, you're not going to dark hole yourself. So, yeah. But you can just draw to that Regeki and be like, okay, well, I don't even care if you only have one monster because I'm going to go for a game anyway. Regeki game. So, yeah. I'm just, yeah. yeah. It's still pretty broken. It's just uh, yeah, the not... state of the game is now a lot different. Yeah. Yeah, I I would much rather give you two dark holes before giving you a Regeki, but eh, I'm not Konami. Yeah, I, I agree. You know what card's actually getting kind of hyped and going up in price, which is kind of stupid? What? Anti-Regeki. Lol, what? Because <laughs> yeah, it's from freaking Tournament Pack 3, so it's like freaking, go it's like $40 right now. No, yeah, it's like, what the heck? I got read it and I was just like, okay, when you put on face Regeki, you destroy their monsters and that like... No, I'm good. I'd rather play Starlight Road. Maybe you won't even the main deck Regeki anyway. Yeah, people aren't going to main deck Regeki anyway, but that's just kind of dumb how you're just like, oh yeah, Regeki coming back. I gotta get this anti-Regeki. Like, no, nah, it's not even that serious. If it was that serious, just play Starlight Road. <laughs> you know, especially with everybody having freaking access to a Starter Dragon with the reprint. Like, just play Starlight Road. Don't go out of your way for anti regeki It's not even worth the trouble. Don't worry about that card. Hmm. Should no. attack into it or not? Uh, I wouldn't. Now, <laughs> now if they're both using Shadals, then yeah. Ooh, T King. Uh. Wow. Okay. <sighs> I was trying to think of the hell I was going to say. Like, Regeki, uh, it probably won't do anything. But I, I, yeah, you I'm, don't. I'm, I'm, I'm worried about Konami getting into this really, uh, you know, liberal mentality. And they'll be like, well, well, Regeki didn't do anything at one. Let's put it up to two or three. Like, no, 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 no. You know? I'm, I'm, I just don't want them to do that. Well, if the card is now passed, there is no point in uh, keeping the, that card on the list. But it could be bad, this current format, but you know, the game changes. You know? Yeah. The only reason true. why it's not that good is because of the particular format it's in. If this was a couple formats ago, then Regeki would still be really good. You know? so I don't want just the Konami to get into this mentality that they can go ahead and just, you know, bring Regeki up to three just because it's not good, this current format, because the card's so powerful. Like, you can have one, that's it. But not, not more, not more. <laughs> that's, that's one of the cards that deserves its spot on the list. Um, yeah, possibly. All right, so uh, well, what's next? Uh, what the hell is next? Oh, soul charge. To oh one. yeah, soul charge. Well, what again. Heck? What the heck? Why? I didn't even get to play anything. Yeah. Ah. Now we gotta get another Just one. Just want the Thunder King, and that's it. Yeah, Thunder King. That's it. GG. Be right back. Okay, hopefully they won't quit this time, or by the time they quit, I at least get to do yeah. something. <laughs> and we have finished talking, so uh, yeah, Soul Charge to win. Yeah, it should have been banned, Yeah, for I'm, sure. Yeah, I'm actually surprised that Konami did that, TCG Konami, you know. OCG Konami, I could totally see them doing that, but you know, here in the TCG, I thought they were going to be hella conservative and be just be like, nope, ban it. But, okay. But once... at least we won't have to deal with uh, multiple uh, Soul Charges anymore. Yeah, but it's it's gonna get sacky. Uh, I, I, I I already like Monster Reborn was uh, in the past. Yeah, basically. I already put it back in the decks for um for Vitamin Y, just to see. And of course, you know it being a number generator. So, so far, ever since I put in the decks of Vitamin Y, I have drew it every single video. Lol. Like that's a new thing. Instead of drawing you Bell, it's drawing Soul Charge every single video because of the damn number generator. But yeah, I'm okay. If that's what you want to do, Konami. I said, I think that's just kind of broken, but... Yep. Uh, and uh, Super Poly one. Oh, look, you got T-King. And again, opened with Thunder King. Yep. Kind of unusual. <laughs> it's not unusual, it's the number generator. It's the power of just cards at one. And watch, he's probably going to hit you with the bottomless. <laughs> I'm not sure if I want to attack or not. Mm -hmm. It's up to you. Okay, I will attack. Let's see what that face the monster is. What could it possibly be? What the fuck? Okay. Okay. You got summon Harpy Some Lady or something? Tech, I guess. Some Harpy Lady? Harpy Channel or something? I guess? Maybe Gustos. That would be annoying. <laughs> Indeed. I don't like that deck. I don't like their monster and then you 
freaking I take the damage you step for freaking throwing goo through that I, mean, I don't like that <laughs> yeah that's a pretty insane card actually <laughs> oh what's I going at this oh okay I guess he's like, like oh. I think a little, little bit of hype because of that new card that was recently revealed yeah I need to talk about that so that but means so that, means people that card stop... won't help enough no at least people can stop bitching about fucking ravine all the damn time no <laughs> because the deck still needs it <laughs> but you ain't getting it <laughs> Alright, uh, Super Poly. Yeah, that was pretty expected, actually. Yeah. yeah. Wasn't that on your, your uh, wish list? Nope. It wasn't? <laughs> yeah, I'm Shuttle not... Fusion was in my wish list. Oh. Not Super Polymerization. It's a little bit too early to be hitting that card. <laughs> <laughs> wow, alright. Well, thank God I got Royal Decree. And there's not much this Dragoonity guy could do. <laughs> like, hello? What are you gonna do? It's C? I can Thunder King's gonna fucking. Okay, whatever, go yep, ahead. Yeah, can negate that. And then you fucking fill up your back row, so therefore the Dragoonity guy can't even freaking equip. Was he gonna lance you or something? No. What the hell is he doing? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh... Okay. Fine. Whatever. Fine. I'm a tech doodle slow. I'm not worried about anything right now. As soon as I flip up that freaking world to create, probably gonna quit, so yeah. Uh yeah, Super Poly was a pretty decent hit. You know, it was on my uh, top five list, I totally didn't mind that card going down to one. Because god, the Super Poly is just so strong. I see it's it's pretty powerful, but I don't think it's uh, broken. In Chanel's hands it is, because they don't miss timing with their effects. That's... Yeah, that's true. But that's the problem with Chateau, it's not, not with Super Polymerization. Okay. What, are you going to make a Black Rose? Or, who are you making? Who the fuck is he? Hmm. No, I'm going to stop you. No. Yeah, I haven't seen anyone... Uh... Why using not? that card. Yeah, oh, who the fuck is he? Okay. It seems like a very bad Trunit deck. Yeah. Okay. You're just gonna poke us for the 16? That's fine. What? Fine. Fine, don't poke us for the 16. Go ahead and take your turn. <laughs> Freaking all the bad people today. All right, let's move on to uh, semi unlimited. So Gale. Um, that's pretty interesting. Black Mies gets something back again. Yeah, I mean, Konami, TCG Konami never said they hated Black Wings. But they sure did say they hate freaking Gladiator Beast. <laughs> Ah, uh, like, uh, how come Gale is going to, but Vitari can't go to? Because fuck Gladiator Beast? <laughs> well, they don't want Gladiator Beast to be a Kizaru spam deck. Yep. Even though Destruction's not good this format, but still, no. <laughs> yeah, so, I, I I don't care. I hate Glides too, so I really don't care. Yeah, Utopia. Too strong. Did you, did you do that on purpose? <laughs> Yeah, because I want to summon that, that thing. <laughs> At least the oh, second wow. one is not a dead throw anymore. With this card. Wow, that is so cool. Oh, we win. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, I don't want to want this thing, or Gosta. Ah, I can't. <laughs> With Royal Decree, I... I um... I don't know. I don't. I... You got that Regeki? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was against it. Uh, yeah. So, yeah, you know, I seriously doubt that Black Wings will still do anything. I wouldn't be surprised. Yeah. If uh, that card went up to three, if they want they to. They are outclassed. Oh, frankly. they actually have it. Of course. Of course they do. <laughs> well. Hey, I mean, they got, you got Thunder King, of course they have Dark Hole. Mm. 
Kvar. Dark World Tech Running Latinum. <laughs> okay. Dark World Dealings. Go ahead and discard the graph of Papa Royal Decree, right? Possibly. <laughs> Go ahead and do it. Dark World Dealings, discard your graph of Pop something. Wow, okay. Or not. Or not. I thought you were gonna summon, return it, fucking Grafa, like usual, it's fucking Dark Worlds. <laughs> I love how Dark Worlds got indirectly hit with the existence of Castel. <laughs> like, yeah. put it back! <laughs> like, yeah, I'm not gonna take you one to one. Why? So you can be in the graveyard again? No, put it back. Hmm. <laughs> My hand is good. Just. Uh. So go ahead and get started with the plays then. Go ahead and make my boss monster. I'm not really worried about the Dragoon Indy guy. At this current moment, he's really down on resources. Yeah, pretty much. Um, uh, course. Yeah, I guess uh, course is not that great anymore either. Yeah. Uh, I'm surprised that they moved Gorse out to two, but didn't move Trag up to a three. Yeah. Really surprised about that. Oh, no. Because uh, many uh, currently play, play a lot of back rows, so of course it's not uh, yeah, that good. <laughs> I have nothing to say! <laughs> Lol, didn't use the transaction effect. <laughs> to discard the graph- uh, Why are you bad? I don't ask for vibes, just give me a good duel! <laughs> for my boss monster. This is not really a boss monster. It's, it's a my... setup card. Oh, my setup go to guy. <laughs> uh, uh, I don't know. Maybe an X-list. they be like, oh, of course didn't do anything. Chad didn't do anything. Let's put him up. And I said, I, I, guess, I, I guess TCG Konami is a little bit more liberal than I anticipated them to be. Okay. Well, as long as they don't bring uh, broken cards back, then I definitely don't mind it. Okay, so if he equips, I can MST it? Yes. No. You don't need that. So, I, uh, what else? What else? Uh, Transmigration Prophecy. Yeah, that shouldn't have been hit in the first place, so... Yeah, they're gonna put it to two, they're gonna put up to three. Like I said, all it does is create yeah, most this, likely. this little loop thing with itself, but that's not even relevant. Oh, I can't back out! Like, I guess. Like, when's the last time, time yeah, someone... Yeah, who cares? Yeah, when's the last time someone beat someone by backing out besides Empty Jar? Like, no, that's not even a thing. Like if you're that concerned about decking out, then you might want to reevaluate your deck because you should either, either you should be no not decking out and taking it slow and be a slower deck, or you should be so aggressive with your deck that you should be able to uh, kill your opponent before you deck out anyway. You know, even Lightstone should be able to kill you before they deck out, unless you unless they're going against a control deck that completely walls them. Yep. So not even care about that. So definitely gonna predict that going up to three for the next list. Um. And uh, ceasefire. Yes, I definitely don't want chain burn to get more cards. Yeah, I don't like that either. I don't like that either. Like, yay! Thanks, thanks for giving fucking chain burn like the most powerful burn card in Yu-Gi-Oh. Like, thanks. Why? There's no point in you even doing that. But okay, I guess Konami. That's dumb. There's a lot of other cards that you could have moved, but sure. Yes. Yeah, that's that's one of the things that I'm definitely frowning upon. Um, what else? I guess cards unlimited. Uh, I predict shit out of that. Oh, I very much prediction. <laughs> like, these three cards are gonna get unlimited. <laughs> the Magician of Faith, Formula, and Rota. Yeah. Pretty uh, expected moves. Yeah. So, Formula Sincon, who gives a fuck? Magician of Faith, who gives a fuck? You know, if you want to run three Magician of Faith in, in one soul charge, then more power to you. I doubt anybody's gonna do that, though. Um. Oh, you're just gonna get rid of everything. Yep, indeed. Its effect is not one, one, not once per turn. What the? I'm, uh, I don't know. Not that dragon can't fire, but 
Uh, I apologize. I apologize. We couldn't get a good duel. I mean, our our plays are skilled, but them, yeah, I would. Sure. Well, that won't help. <laughs> you just wanted to play it just to waste time. Uh, what else? Uh, Rhoda. I predict that lots of people are like, no, Rhoda's not going to go up to three. Rhoda's not going to go up to three. I'm like, why wouldn't it go up to three? <laughs> and it did. And God. Like people, you know, people are like, oh, yeah, Rhoda up to three. The three, you know, Satella Knights and uh, and uh, Noble Knights. Oh yeah, like, like um, I have three Tanky and three Rota. You're gonna get. Can I put the number eight into attack mode? Yeah, sure, go ahead. But yeah, like I have three Tanky and three Rota. You're gonna get Pleiades. <laughs> you are. Um, <laughs> uh, and uh, Wolf Bark. Wolf Bark, I did not see. I, I know everybody yeah. is cr crying and, and, and yelling it, but I'm surprised actually Konami did it, you know? It's like, okay. There, you know, I just didn't see any reason to move it, you know? Why? So you can bring back... It, so why? You know, so people I can't even... I didn't want to seem hypocritical by uh, keeping Wolfpark at one and having uh, things like uh, Saturnite Altar and uh, uh, Tionea in the game and some other cards. It's not hypocritical. It's all about making <laughs> that money, and clearly you're making that money. No, mm. Altair. Sure, Hunter or Rada Kree, Not sure. Uh, it depends on well, it's on what you know. He's probably gonna pop the plane coat, so I guess go ahead and just discard the Rada Kree, I guess. Yeah. Oh, I was wrong. Oh, okay, that was surprising. I don't know. That was real surprising. I totally thought you were gonna freaking pop the plane coat. So how the fuck are you gonna deal with the plane coat? <laughs> Classic dark role play. Wow, graph and defense mode. You don't see that very often. Wow. What? <sighs> Why are they bad? <laughs> no idea. I know. Fucking... Most don't. They're probably pretty bad, actually. Like on most uh, online dwelling plat platforms. <laughs> You know, they're sitting behind their computer screen. They don't have to worry about sitting across the table from someone who will actually call them a noob. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, you know, I, I don't think it... I, I, if they would have kept Wolfbark at one, I, I wouldn't have think it was hypocritical. I would have I would have thought it was a business plan. You know? Altair, you're making money off of Satellanites. That's your thing. <laughs> Dianara, you're clearly... Space Time Trap holds one of your money cards in the set, so... Yeah. I, I didn't think it was bad you know I, i'm just i'm actually kind of confused about it i'm just like so you want to get them through wolf bark so people can even attempt to play freaking plus one fire fist again i mean i know it's not the best deck this format but you know even giving that deck a chance to even combat the meta is not a wise business plan you know but well, uh, maybe they are not the bot money all the time oh. i know that's why i'm shocked that's why i'm shocked about this list they're so damn liberal you know and, and they didn't even try you know testing the waters at two they just said here you go we hit it Two less later, here you go. We're done. You know, fuck it. Like, well, maybe they want to make money uh, from the mega tins. You know, just... Wolf Park got reprinted in there as well. Yeah, I guess that might be it. Yeah, you, know? you know, I'm just like, you move back Wolf Park, but you don't even think about moving Spirit. <laughs> like, okay, fine. Okay. Hmm. All right, wrap this duel up. <laughs> oh man, I could have been a, I could have, you could have been a real big you brought... I probably could have left the Castell there, and then during your turn, fucking spun it back. No, I could have attacked, but spun it back into his partner's deck. <laughs> like, Dark Worlds get that indirect and hit. This is over. Yep, that's it. So, yeah, like I already said, I'm actually working on my uh, my January ban list prediction already. <laughs> already. Already, already. I've already started on it, so uh, you guys are looking forward to it. So. Oh, you know, just simple liberal moves. Of course, I can't, you know. It's pretty much right now all I got is liberal moves, moves that I doubt will affect anything, so we can go ahead and move it. Um, you know, hits that didn't get hit last time that Konami might hit, and then the rest of the prediction will be, you know, problem cards that we see in this next couple of months, these next three months. But besides yes. that, 
this list, this upcoming list will be more liberal, much more liberal, you know, depending on, uh, yeah, like the next list. If, if Shadows doesn't get unbanned in the next list, then he won't get unbanned because that, this is his, uh, this upcoming list, this general list, that's his list. Um, whether, uh, I'm surprised that Dark Hack Fighter didn't get, well, no, it'll be next list because he'll probably get his reprint and errata in the 5 Diesel and then get un, un released in yeah, the next list. So that's the next list because I doubt they would do it early because then, you know, they haven't got the errata yet, so Dark Track Fighter would still be stupid. So, yeah, it'll be next list. If Dark Track Fighter gets unhit, it'll be next list as well. So, lots of uh, liberal moves in this upcoming list. Should be interesting. All right, so that's all I got to discuss. So we gotta go. I gotta go ahead. Oh, actually, this is actually the second half. So uh, I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Daily Bills. Thank you, Omega Cast, for joining me. No problem. You got anything else to say? Nope. <laughs> so uh, uh, thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Uh, Starting with Stanzi using uh, Quackamero. Thanks for watching.